They want to know if cell phone use played a role in a deadly crash involving an ambulance. Police say Kevin French was driving an ambulance along a Knox County road when he hit a group of teenagers on bicyclists in August of 2014. 14-year-old Samson Callender was killed in that crash, and French was indicted last year in connection to the crash. New at 5, Phil Pendleton talks to French's attorney about the cell phone evidence. The collision between the ambulance and some kids on bikes happened here on 25E in August of 2014. The indictment states that French was allegedly under the influence of intoxicants. But French's attorney tells me he believes his client is innocent. And this was simply just an accident. And he says now he does not understand why police are so interested in his cell phone. This is simply a fishing expedition. The affidavit for the search warrant does not set out any reason to believe that there would be any evidence in his phone. David Hoskins represents Kevin French, whom police say was under the influence when the Knox ambulance hit several kids on bikes, killing the 14-year-old. Court papers are seeking all records pertaining to calls, texts, and data on French's phone. But there is no evidence that he was using his phone in any way. He just had his phone with him. Regardless of what the phone shows, Hoskins says the jury will also not have enough evidence to prove he was impaired when the ambulance crashed. Because even if there was anything in his blood, it was such a minimal level that it could not have impaired his ability to drive and did not impair his ability to drive. And prosecutors tell me that they simply want the jury to have access to any and all information and to be able to understand everything that French was doing at the time of the crash. In Knox County, Phil Pendleton, WKYT. French and the Knox County Ambulance Service are also defendants in a civil suit. It states that French was driving negligent, careless, and reckless when that crash happens.